Good afternoon. Um, today I'm going to be talking about a major issue in Major League Baseball that has recently come to light. That topic would be electronically stealing signs during live games. Throughout our course, we have talked a lot about deviance and proper sportsmanship and how behavior of professionals can trickle down into high school and even little leagues. Recently, the Houston Astros have been accused of electronically stealing signs during games. What they would do was they would have a live feed of the game going on in the dugout while also having a cameraman set up in center field that would zoom in on the catcher's signs and there would be someone in the dugout that would look at the signs and then a person would use a metal trash can to bang on it to notify the batter of what the pitch was. For example, one bang curveball, two bang slider, and etc. To some people, this wouldn't sound that bad, but in Major League Baseball, it is highly illegal. The Boston Red Sox had a similar accusation of which using Apple Watches in the dugouts to seal signs, which eventually resulted in a multi-million dollar fine. The main reason that what the Astros and Red Sox did in particular was wrong was because they did it electronically, which is clearly stated in the MLB rules as an illegal act. Stealing signs without any form of electronics has been a part of baseball since it's been founded over 100 years ago. There's a big difference in a runner at second base giving a sign to a batter than having people that have nothing to do with the game watching live signs and ultimately giving a team an advantage. Deviance in baseball has caused a major decline in the overall product of the sport. One of baseball's greatest downfalls in the modern era would be the use of performance-enhancing drugs. After Barry Bonson and Alex Rodriguez were accused of using these drugs, baseball-related er, ratings decreased dramatically. And even the prices of prize memorabilia, memorabilia saw a decline. What is so compelling about what the Astros did was during the period they were accused in, they ended up winning a World Series in 2017. This makes it really hard to give them a punishment. It's almost impossible to completely vacate the world championship. If I was Major League Baseball, I would put a punishment in place to ensure that no teams try to partake in this behavior in the future. What I would do is I would place a one-year postseason ban on the Astros, along with taking away their next five first-round picks and giving the organization at least a $2 million fine. As for the rest of the league, I would ban any sort of electronics in the dugout, including live streams of games and not allowing teams to use iPads or whatever it is to look at a certain play once it's happened. I think that the Jumbotron should be the extent as to what teams can use their advantage within a game. And if a team is caught even using a TV or an iPad during a game, I think it should result in a heavy fine. The goal of all of this is to keep the game fair and fun for everyone and giving every team an equal, an equal chance to win each season. Thank you for your time and enjoy your day.